Today on City Line. Take a glam picture. We have to talk about this. My name's Gold. Come Hello. on. Hello. Come on, ladies. You Come on. This. this is so bling worthy. I love it. But this is like for P. Diddy or J. Lo. to photography with Winston Sieg and the big hand. Winston. We all know everybody has that camera on their phone and people we are constantly do. clicking all the time. All day and all night. But it's funny because there's this real movement going back to right. the origins of photography. You know, original photography, kind of the old school stuff that a lot of us grew up on. And, and there are apps out there like Instagram that allow you to put cool filters onto your phone so that you get that old feel to it. So there's that real resurgence of uh, retro and vintage yes. photos, if you will. Absolutely. So I have two photos here, Tracy, of uh, myself and you. Tell me, what what is the difference between the two? Do you see any? Okay, my, oh, so that's Winston. That was Winston like five years ago. Just joking. Five years. I'm just <laughs> again jo with the jokes. I'm Tracy. just kidding. <laughs> and this is me back in I don't know. That's probably late 70s, oh, early 80s. With uh, what? I'm probably like what three? I'm born in 75, 78. <laughs> <laughs> and you can tell the difference every time someone pulls out one of these photos photos with the rounded edges and everything looks a little bit sort of fuzzy and not clear soft focus that's the 70s. Well it has a story it's really nice. It so, does have a story and a lot of people are looking to try and get that look yeah. now aren't they? And nowadays like you said they're trying to get uh, that same look and mm -hmm. I found this great store uh, here in Toronto as well as across Canada and across different uh, around the world and it's called Lomography. Okay. And Lomography allows you to get a, a bunch of these different cool cameras and they're all very unique in itself. They are so awesome these and cameras. I, I love an them. example here uh, today to show you. So this one is called the uh, Lubitel uh -huh. and tr you can look at the picture through the bottom here. So if you see here you can look through it and you can see the picture that's coming out the top. And it's got a really unique look to it. It's really retro and vintage, which is really neat. I love and that. That's super, super. A great example like old is school. here of that picture here. Okay, so that's the picture you can take yep, with this right camera. Here. Yeah. Very cool. All right. So how about this guy right here? I love that. This is called the Lokimono, and okay. it is a uh, analog movie maker. So okay. what you do is you actually there's a lever here that you turn, and it takes a bunch of pictures here. And then there's a strike. Uh, you get a, you can develop it into a strip, and you can see different pictures here. Or you can take your film, put it into here, and then hold it up to the light, and you can watch your movie through here. So That's not, amazing. it's very easy to develop these pictures because it does use film. And the best part is so a lot of these cameras yeah. are uh, really inexpensive. So uh, you can get cameras from thirty dollars all the way to three hundred dollars, and you can develop film, you know, at your local drugstore all the way down to your your real uh, niche photography store. Well, I was going to ask you about that when it comes to developing that's where I would think there'd be an issue. A lot is it of hard people, to find places to that's develop. Exactly true. A lot of people think it's really difficult to develop these, yeah. these pictures here but really there are, there are many stores out there that allow you to do that. Very nice. Yeah. Okay let's talk about this guy. Now this is called a uh, Sardina camera and okay. it's really neat because um, again it has a unique look to it. You get that really retro look to it. I and, love it. And you put the film in and then you take the picture there is a uh, button here that you push and it allows you to take the picture here. So but are these actually Actually old cameras that they've restored? No, these are new cameras. These are new cameras that they've but made they local. They have that look to it. You yeah. almost feel like you need the guy with but the blanket and a puff of smoke goes <laughs> off and like a big light flashes in your face. Yeah. Doesn't it seem like that? Yeah, and but it the looks pictures amazing. come out really well. It looks okay. like a sardine can. So um, this one, this is so cool. This is so like 80s or and something. And it's very 80s. And there is an, a great example here. Um, I'm just going to pull it up. And it takes four simultaneous pictures at once. And oh, it takes so you get the Andy shot. Warhol look. Andy Warhol I love look, that. Which is great. That's so cool. Yeah. Oh, so many people are using that. Uh, mm -hmm. They're using that on their, in their twit pics and everything. Amazing. Now these, okay, no, we have to talk about this. I mean, it's gold. Come Hello. on. Hello. Come on, ladies. You Come love on. This. this is so bling worthy. I love it. This is like for P. Diddy or J. Lo. And it is a fish. They would talk to me if I had this camera, don't you think? Yeah, they look, would. Look, I'm like part of their crew. Yeah, okay, so tell that. me about this camera. How does uh, it work? It's a fisheye camera. And okay. it, it, it takes really neat pictures here. You can see, um, again, you get oh, that yeah. really neat effect there. And um, it, it has that fisheye lens on it. Yeah. And here you can see that. That's very cool. And then digital. I just want to carry it around like a clutch. And then, and then the digital it. cameras there, and then this is one of my favorites here, Tracy. And okay. This is the uh, end here. Ooh, panoramic. Panoramic photos, 360. We're gonna hold it up here, and this camera here, as you can see, you pull it, and it spins, and it takes a 360 oh, photo here. Oh, that's cool. Okay, could you just pull and spin one, one more time? time? 
That's so cool. So then it gets whatever I'm landscape break this you tracer. want. <laughs> I'm gonna break this. Sorry. It's worth it. That is so cool. I'll pay for it. I love it. Okay. okay, did you talk about these ones? These are modern these day. These are modern day cameras. Digital cameras. So, you know, you can, if you just want a basic camera, these are great to have. These are yeah. from Future Shop, uh, Canon and uh, Nikon. And uh, they're really easy to throw in your pocket. Go to the cottage. Yeah. You know, they're the ones for the real enthusiasts out there, and there's the basic ones here. So, and then lastly, we have the hybrid. Uh, this is the Fuji film. Okay. Uh, and it gives you that uh, modern feel as yeah. well as the retro feel. Looks retro, but really, if you turn it around, there's a digital screen on here. Oh, and it's a I digital like camera. that. So then you know it's going to be easy. You get Lovely. your digital photos, you Love can do whatever it. you need to do with them. Thank yeah. you, Winston. Give Thank him a big you. hand. Let's go to break. Thank you so much for contributing on the show today. I love this. By the stuff. way, I love this. Isn't that so cool? Oh. Thank you.